Now to our continuing coverage of California's drought concerns. The third snow survey of the season was conducted today at Phillips Station near Sierra at Tahoe. ABC 10's meteorologist Carly Gomez was breaking down the message from the Department of Water Resources today. At December, January, and February are traditionally our three wettest months of the water year. However, this past January and February were actually the driest consecutive January and February on record. The March 1st snow survey showing a massive drop off from December's record snowfall. Phillips Station recorded 68% of average for the water year with the snow water equivalent of 16 inches. Compare that to December and January's averages and we're nowhere close. Despite the snow water being able to run off into reservoirs, experts say it's just not enough to fill them up. Without any significant storms on the horizon, uh, it's safe to say that we'll end this year dry and continue on into the third year of this ongoing drought. The state's largest reservoir, Shasta, is only at 37% of capacity. Lake Orville at 47% full and Folsom Lake at 54%. Hydrologist Jeremy Hill says moving forward, we will need to continue applying the best technology and science at our disposal. Help us to better manage water in real time and also use forecasts to maximize the benefits of the runoff that we do get when we get it and also minimize uh, potential hazards. 